Temperature control in your home can be expensive no matter what the season. Your old thermostat can also be one of the reasons maintaining a comfortable temperature even costs more. Installing a smart thermostat can be a great, quick and easy way for you to make your home more efficient and save some money in the long run. Today, I'm going to show you how. I'll be installing the Ecobee Smart Thermostat, but these tips will pretty much work for any modern unit. When you pull the cover from your current thermostat off the wall, you can see colored wires running into the wall. Ecobee actually has an online compatibility checker, but you could probably find something similar for your thermostat's online installation resource. I would recommend a pen and some masking tape for this process. For the Ecobee thermostat specifically, you'll need a drill with a 3 16 drill bit, a Phillips head screwdriver, and a flathead screwdriver. Your installation guide will also tell you what's needed and what's included. Turn off the power to your HVAC system on your home's breaker box. Confirm that it's totally off by trying to turn it on again and making sure that no air is blowing through your AC vents. Remove the screws and take the old thermostat off of the wall. After that's done, you'll want to remove the wires. They should have letters next to each of them. You can then use masking tape to label them. You can take a photo or in the Ecobee's case, you can actually use these handy stickers that come in the box. If the screw holes line up, you can use the old ones. Otherwise, use your drill to make new ones. After installing your anchors, connect your new sub-base to the wall over where your old thermostat was located. Then you'll connect each wire to the correct terminal in your new sub-base. Attach your new cover to the sub-base, and then the last thing to do is to turn it on and set the temperature. After only about 45 minutes and a little bit of work, now the temperature in your home is being regulated more efficiently. You'll even be saving a little bit of money and who doesn't love that? If you enjoyed this video, let us know. Leave a comment below and let us know what tips you wanna see from us next.